hello viewers good day to you all in this video we're going to show you how to trace a trend market the trend market is divided into two we have the uptrend and the downtrend so in this video we're going to show you the uptrend this is the first one so guys don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos so guys we say uptrend here is the uptrend market as you can see in this video this uptrend market is doing the higher higher and the higher low what we mean with the higher higher and the higher low is that now we're gonna show you if you look at here the market starts trending up the market is trending up and if you look at here we draw the support trend line and uh, after the support trend line we draw the vertical line which also become a spot a resistance so in this point guys whenever you enter your chart you find out the market is trending off what you need to do first is to draw your support trend line so after you draw the spot trend line don't forget guys when you are drawing your spot trend line or resistance you don't need to force it you place it you should place it how it's supposed to be if you didn't find the two touches two point what i mean with two point is that you can see here is the one and the here is the two so look at in this chart you can see it form three point so this point are what is called higher low let's add the resistance trend line now we should add it let's add it so that we can the complete analysis of the trend here it is here is our resistance trend line as you can see so now if, if you look at inside you can see how the market is trending up from the higher low to higher higher so in this case guys what we need to do is to look for the buying opportunity because the market here is uptrend and the uptrend market if you can switch to the bigger time frame you can get the clear picture of the market you can see that the market is in strong buying so what we need to do here is to look for buying opportunity because if you look for selling opportunity you are trading against the trend and it's very very dangerous don't try it you should always be patient until you find a clear direction of the market to make a safe trade so now you are to place your trade from the higher low and exit at higher higher here is a higher low you are to enter when the market failed to break your uh, the support trend line then you entered the market you entered the market and after you entered the market don't forget to place your stop loss because the market is not your friend the market is not your friend so you are to exit at this point you are to exit at this point but this resistance before it's been broke to become a spot is your tp1 you can place your tp1 and exit there but you can allow the markets to break it until it reached the major resistance level which is this one so after you exit play you can still look for selling opportunity but it's very very dangerous better look for buying opportunity this bed can spot is also very important you can see here the market reached the major resistance trend line and uh, the market reverse is selling and uh, it comes here it comes to this support vertical line and uh, it didn't break it it reverse back to from the another higher higher so it's your second opportunity to look for buying so this vertical line that you are seeing inside is also very very important as we told you the important of it is that 
if you place it if you draw it here you can see when the market break i'll reach the major resistant trend line and uh, the market didn't break it i reverse from that resistant trend line when the market reverse we are expecting the market to rest on that vertical line for example like here you see and uh, the market we are expecting to form another higher higher from it when it also reached the resistant trend line and uh, it didn't break it it will pass from that point and uh, we are expecting the market to come and rest on the vertical line as you are seeing here is our vertical line we draw it the market come from this point goes up and uh, comes comes back rest on it goes up and the comes back rest on it it's just a retracement move so don't go for it and uh, we also have the impulsive move now the, the impulsive move is what you should consider in uptrend market because it is the buying opportunity so it's better to look for impulsive move than to look for retracement move so thanks for watching guys don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos for more strategies and setup and uh this we just brought you the uh, uptrend market and uh, later we're gonna uh, we're gonna